Well, with Fed Chair Janet Yellen today signaling the economy is okay, and her vice chair, Stanley Fisher, saying we could have two rate hikes this year, the markets got nervous. But is a rate hike before the election really possible? Let's bring in our market panel, Steve Forbes, Forbes Media Chairman and Editor in Chief, and Jack Howe, Senior Editor at Barron's. Steve, let's be political here. Uh, Janet Yellen, I would be willing to bet every penny that I have ever earned that she does not want Donald Trump to be president. She knows that if there's a rate hike before the election, his chances improve a little because uh, the market would probably do what it did the last time it was a rate hike and go way down. So isn't there a political consideration in betting that the Fed will not hike rates before the election? Oh, forsooth, David, how <laughs> can you allow these evil thoughts enter your brain? Uh, absolutely. And uh, Yellen, I think, is more discreet than her uh, counterpart on the Supreme Court. Uh, Ginsburg, uh, Justice Ginsburg, who just let it out what she thought of a Donald Trump and the Republican Party. But uh, no, they believe that the raising rates will uh, somewhat uh, dampen economic activity. Actually, if they did a few things right, it would help. But that's beyond their understanding. Jack, do you think Janet Yellen would do anything to help hire a guy who said the first thing he's going to do if president is fire her? Well, I, I want in on the conspiracy theory. Let, let me extend it. She's watching the broadcast right now. She just heard you. And knowing that you think that, there's going to be a quarter point bump. So at just the end to of get David Asman, she's going to keep you on your toes. I, I don't think so. But seriously, I mean, is, this is one of those times I, the Fed has been involved in politics before. We all know it. We don't admit it at the time. But isn't it time to turn that around and admit it? Well, it's happening. Look, look at the market today. What we lose? 50 points in the Dow. That's the market saying, meh, another quarter point. We're coming from zero. We're at a quarter point now. The last now. time we raised so we a quarter, the markets went down 10 percent, Jack. We're, we're there was a huge correction. We're, we're talking at the possibility of gradually raising okay. the Fed funds rate. We're, we're from nothing, a quarter point now, maybe we'll get up gradually to 1 percent over the next year. Then stay there and see if the world comes to an end or not. I don't think it will.